Our thoughts, our deepest privacy, may one day become common property. With the use of an MRI machine, AI can read a human brain using stable diffusion software, meaning it can generate images from text. Your brain activities will go into our AI translator, and this translator will translate your brain activities into a special language that a stable diffusion can understand. And then it will generate um, the images you are seeing at that point. In Singapore, up to 58 volunteers will be scanned for research, full of curiosity, their brains and thoughts completely revealed. This uh, brain decoding, like using brain signals to generate the natural modalities, is a very interesting and uh, exciting job. The volunteers will be exposed to tens of thousands of different images. The AI will produce individual models for each person. So, after we collect enough training data for you, we can create an individual AI model for you. And this AI model is kind of a translator. Well, it can understand your brain activities just like ChatGPT understand the natural languages of humans. Groundbreaking as it may be, this level of intrusion can be scary. These computers may one day know us better than we know ourselves. If not used responsibly, consequences could be devastating. The researchers working on this project are very aware of the ethical dilemma it poses and say this new tech must be heavily regulated. Oh, wow. So the thing to address this is we should have very strict uh, guidelines, ethical and, and law in terms of how to protect the privacy. This is all part of a new boost in AI development. One day, this new software will merge with our virtual reality hardware, eliminating the need for physical controllers, the mind literally in control.